Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, look, here's what I'm gonna talk about because I've been asked about them. ladies. They got husband, boyfriend, pen pals, and pen tenure. So they asked me, how many people you think is gay in prison, fleet? I said, well, when I was down the grain, the grain held about 2,500 inmates. I said out of that 2,500, it was at least about 2,000 that, that was messing around. How many? About 2,000. Out of how many? Out of 2,500. That's just in the grains. And Eddieville holds about 18 to 20, uh, 100 inmates. You be lucky in Eddieville to find 30 inmates that ain't been doing nothing. You be good and lucky. So, now, I'm not going to call everybody gay that ever went to prison. But I can tell you this, I was in prison 40-something years. So I'm going to tell you the truth. I've seen people mess around in prison, you know, the, the good-looking men with the strong bodies, with the look like they've been lifting weights all their life, big chest, six-pack, keep their hair shaped and nice-looking, get visits, wives and stuff, come and see them. Get money from the street. I seen them take that money and give it to a sissy in prison. A lot of them. Go out on a visit, kiss their wife, come back in, suck a dick. I mean, I done seen all this stuff, right? Uh, one inmate came out the street, turned gay in prison. He gonna send his son a picture of him with some hot pants on and his shirt tied over his stomach. Now when his he had three sons. Now his wife, she was she he been locked up twenty something years. His wife stole stood with him. She driving a Lexus and she fan. He wasn't gay when he was on the street, but he's gay in prison, all the way gay, like a girl. And sent that picture, and you can imagine when his son got the, the, the letter, Mama, I got a letter from Daddy. And she's smiling. By the time he started getting back with you kids, and he opened that letter and pulled that picture out, saw his daddy standing there with lipstick on, eyes or hot pants, shirt tied over his stomach like a bitch. Now this particular son, he was considered a pillar in his community. Everybody said he was so nice. Every time you see him, he'll holler at you, how y'all doing? You need anything I can help you with? When he got that picture from his daddy, it wasn't a week later, he dead. Now he's coming out of the house with an attitude every day. Somebody speak to him, how you doing, young man? Fuck you. Kiss my ass, all that. They shot and killed him. I told his daddy, you should have never sent your son. He said, I want my kids to know and accept me for who I am. Well, you could have waited till you got out of prison to do that, bro. You know, you could have waited till you got out of the damn prison before sending your kids uh, a picture of you gay. And uh, he's out now. He lives in Lexington. They call him JJ, Jonathan Johnson. 